Hi everybody, Kenneth G. Hasty here. Today's video is called Be Uncommon. So what does Be Uncommon mean? Well, you know, you think about people that have uncommon jobs, like major corporation CEOs, and you start looking at what are the habits that they have? What, what habits have developed? Have they developed that, that us common folk haven't developed? And for starters, many of them get up between 3.30 and 4.30 in the morning. Very common among that crowd. And they do that so that they have some focus time, some time before they have to, you know, make the commute to their offices, et cetera, and get things done, you know, whether it's to work out, study, yoga, whatever. Um, depends on, you know, whose book you read. But definitely an uncommon trait, something to consider. Two is um, most successful business leaders are avid readers. They'll read... Uh, you know, several books every month. And so ask yourself this on business. Are you reading several business books every month? Um, you know, I tried. I had, uh, uh, and I'm an author. <laughs> but I, I, even right now, my nice thing, I've got three half-read books. Well, for me, what I started doing was uh, using Audible on Amazon. And I'm ripping through those books when I'm driving in the car, which is great. So I'm staying more current on the latest business books, which is good for my clients, right? Something I recommend you try. Next is... Uh, Keep up a regular exercise routine. You know, if, if your body fails you, then you're, you're kind of out of business in many ways, right? So make sure you're taking care of your body, and your body will take care of you. You know, I know this seems basic, but a lot of people don't, you know, who I'm talking to, right? Um, focus on your faith. You know, there's, there's a Bible verse. It's uh, Matthew 8, 36. I'll read it to you. It says, For what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul. Pretty heavy words right there. So, you know, if you're a person of faith, then make sure you're investing some time into that. You might, might want to consider if, if you haven't been to church for a while or been to a synagogue for a while or whatever your faith may be, I want to consider doing that. Um, and last but not least is plan time for your relationships. You know, the people that you know, I forget who did the, who said this, but it stuck with me. It's a, kind of a famous saying, so I apologize that I can't um, quote who exactly is the one that's noted for it. But it's simply this. Spend your time with the people who will cry at your funeral because nobody else really matters. So I'll come through this list once again and being uncommon, develop productive habits, you know, get up early, whatever it may be. Um, Read books on business and, you know, things that will help you with your business. And stay current. Um, keep up on your exercise habits. Your body will take care of you if you take care of it. Focus on your faith. Pretty important. And um, take time for your relationships. You know, there's people that love you that you're not spending enough time with. So that's what i got to say about that. So be uncommon. And by being uncommon, you'll be successful in all aspects of your life. So Kenneth G. Hasty, I'm a professional business growth consultant. You can check me out at KennethGHasty.com. You can email me, Kenneth at KennethGHasty.com. Or if you'd like to talk on the phone, talk a little business, you know, talk about us helping your business, what have you, I'll put a link in there too. It might might even be in the comment section, but it's a link where you can sync with my calendar and make a phone appointment. All right, so thanks everybody. Kenneth G. Hasty signing off. Take care. Bye.